I didn't know that even if he was a bad person, that he would do something to me. R. Kelly's estranged daughter has been carrying a heartbreaking childhood secret. In a new documentary, Joanne Kelly, who also goes by the name Buku Abi, shares details about her experience growing up with the R&B singer, who is currently serving a 30-year prison sentence for sex crimes against underaged girls. Joanne, who was not named as one of the victims during Kelly's 2021 trial, opens up in the TVEI network documentary R. Kelly's Karma, A Daughter's Journey. A trailer for the special was released September 29th. He was my everything. <laughs> For a long time, I didn't even want to believe that it happened. I didn't know that even if he was a bad person, that he would do something to me. I really feel like that one millisecond completely just changed my whole life. According to TVEI, Kelly's daughter bravely reveals a heartbreaking secret that shattered her childhood in the documentary. In the trailer, a tearful Joanne also vows to be open about her experiences with her son and keep him away from the singer. If my son asks questions, I'm going to be as truthful as possible. But I would not be taking my son to a prison to meet his grandfather. <laughs> Kelly will be eligible for release from prison in 2045 when he is 78 years old. In April, a federal appeals court upheld his convictions on child pornography and enticement charges, more than 18 months after the conclusion of his trial in Chicago, local PBS affiliate WTTW reported. Joanne's mother, R. Kelly's ex-wife Drea Kelly, also appears in the documentary. Just because you're not a good husband doesn't mean you can't be a good father. And the fact that he didn't even try. What he did to me, he did to me. But you didn't have to do it to my damn kids. In 2019, Joanne spoke out about her father after the release of the docuseries Surviving R. Kelly, which chronicled allegations of abuse and pedophilia that others made about the singer. The project preceded an investigation against Kelly that helped lead to his conviction of racketeering and sex trafficking. And a year later, convictions for felony sexual exploitation of a child, enticement of a female, and possession of material containing child pornography. Joanne wrote on her Instagram story at the time, The same monster you all confronting me about is my father. I am well aware of who and what he is. I grew up in that house. My choice to not speak on him and what he does is for my peace of mind, my emotional state, and for my healing. I have to do and move in a manner that is best for me.